And on this busy holiday afternoon, we are stopping by Casenza's Fish Market on 2354 Arthur Avenue, where this is the Feast of Seven Fishes, which is an Italian-American tradition of celebration on Christmas Eve with fish and other seafood. Little Italy on Arthur Avenue is a staple for Italian food, and for the holidays, tradition means everything. We stopped by Randazzo Seafood and Consensus Fish Market to talk about the Feast of the Seven Fishes. The Feast of the Seven Fishes has to do with the uh, seven sacraments in the Catholic Church. And Christmas Eve, Italians traditionally make uh, seven different types of fish on Christmas Eve. Uh, the most popular ones are bacala, eels, uh, a pulpo, uh, a seafood salad, which consists of sea, uh, pulpo, octopus, calamari, shrimps, scongili, make a nice salad. Uh, a lot of people make scallops, uh, filet of sole, bronzino is very popular, um, red snapper, salmon, of course, is very popular, and shrimp. Casenza's Fish Market is a uh, establishment since 1918 been in business almost 107 years and I'm uh, fourth generation. Today's event's very special. It's uh, the Feast of Seven Fishes for Christmas Eve. Uh, the Seven Fishes represents the seven hills of Rome, the seven sacraments, and also the seven days in a week is where they get seven fishes from. Although the historical and commercial center of Little Italy is Arthur Avenue itself, the area stretches across East 187th Street from Arthur Avenue to Beaumont Avenue. My grandfather started, it's almost 100 years. Yes, and me and my brother are running it now, and we're here each over 40 years each. This neighborhood has a lot of significance in the Italian community and the Feast of the Seven Fishes, and this is a staple that's been on this street for 106 years so it's very special to see all the families and the generations after generation continue to come and patronize the store and, and keep up with tradition. The holidays are about celebrating the values that bring us together in life such as friends and family. These important connections can bring us unity through togetherness, generosity, and gratitude. When asked about the importance of the community for both the Consenza and Randazzos, here's what they had to say. People come from you know, far places to come here shopping. A lot of people have been coming here for many years. We know, you know them and their, their children and a lot of the grandchildren too. So they've been coming here for many generations. And it's more of a, like a, a personal experience. You know, we're up, we're close to the customer, we're not behind a counter. And, you know, it's, it's, it's more of a relationship more rather than just a customer coming in and out. Most of these businesses here is third and fourth generation. We're fourth generation. Um, everybody's very friendly with each other. You know, it's like we're family. And this neighborhood's very special. It's, you know, very unique. It's, um, it's an old, old, like an old camaraderie neighborhood where there's not many that still exist. It's probably the, one of the best neighborhoods in the United States. It's still going uh, and it's thriving. Reporting for BronxNet, Chanel Thompson.